Some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Well, hello and welcome back to the channel, everybody. In today's video, we find ourselves in Portland, Oregon, where a man is standing trial for a uh, road rage incident at a parade that took place in June. Well, dude, I wonder if you found this road rage incident to be, well, therapeutic, because this little bit of therapy is going to cost you quite a bit if you are convicted of it. So let's go ahead and sit back, relax, and try not to destroy your laptop or your computer or anything like that that you're watching this on because this is quite stupid of him. This never-before-seen footage shows a Portland man plowing past barricades, nearly hitting several people along the Rose Festival's Grand Floral Parade route in June. Sidney Meacham is facing felony charges for the alleged road rage incident. At the time, there was no clear motive for his speeding toward children and families. The 30-minute recording submitted as evidence in a preventative detention hearing provides new insight into the June 10th incident. The dash cam video shows Meacham become increasingly frustrated by heavy traffic. His music is blaring as Meacham heads towards the Moda Center in North Portland, where he planned to meet others, including his mother. ODOT crews had blocked off numerous exits to help keep traffic away from the parade route. Oh my god! Oh my god. The fucking huh? I'm stuck on the fucking freeways all over the place! They got it all blocked off! The Lloyd Center exit! The Convention Center exit! Every motherfucking exit! You punk <laughs> motherfuckers! Some anger management classes. Yeah, sure, parades can be inconvenient, but there's always a way around them. I mean, just take the detours and try to get around it somehow. I mean, just breathe and say it's not worth it. Take a deep breath in and exhale. It's not worth going to prison over, you dumbass. Dude, this is not Grand Theft Auto. You just can't do that and uh, expect no consequences for your actions. Of course, even in Grand Theft Auto, there will be consequences, but, you know, that's a game. This is real life.
Meacham has pleaded not guilty to 38 counts related to the alleged road rage incident, including felony charges of unlawful use of a weapon and attempting to elude police. No trial date has been set. Well, innocent until proven guilty. That's definitely how it works in the United States. But in this particular scenario, it still applies. But dang, you filmed your crime. So I, I really don't think they'll go light on you, considering that you pled not guilty and didn't take any plea bargain so far. I mean, dude, if I were you, I'd go get a plea bargain right now and hopefully get a light sentence out of this because at least nobody was hurt in in this uh, road rage incident. So, yeah, you got that going for you. But at any rate, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching, and I will see you on the next one. Dude, so there's no way I can get in, bro? Come on, I'll put you on my YouTube. But shut up, Wesley. You gotta put signs up, ma'am, if it's- Are you Glenn Serio? Who's that? You know why you're kicking me out? Cause you don't want wa someone watching a movie in the courthouse. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, I know some of y'all are disappointed. I'm disappointed. Um, I hope that you will continue to watch this channel because this channel has brought more good than negativity. Some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised.